Do you want to work out but cannot afford any equipment? Well, in this video, I will be giving you a tour of my home gym and telling you the mistakes I made in the process of buying all of the equipment I use to this date. And to help you, I will even be telling you the best budget equipment you can buy so you can get started on your fitness gym. So let's get right into it. No print. I'm in gym, but before we can get into any of the good stuff, we have to clean up a bit, because it definitely needs it. So that's what I'm gonna do. Yeah, I gotta protect my enemies. Not everything will deserve my energy. I'm a Steve Jobs, yeah. I think differently. I block out noise and all decoys to limit me. Yes, and the plate doing here. Apple store the back secure that just put my airpods on. I need time to recline. Be with my own yeah. thoughts. Pulling from deep down and into my own vault. I find beauty in the melodies, color in the heart. So, just finished cleaning up the home gym. So now we can get into the actual video. We are going to start off with the elephant in the room, the power rack. This thing is $300 on Amazon and it is amazing. It has a built-in pull-up bar as well as safety bars. I would definitely recommend this. It's also fully adjustable to your size. Next, we have the bench. It costs $125. Now, in my opinion, it doesn't really matter what bench you have, but this one is good because it is fully adjustable. I like this one a lot, but I will tell you an even better alternative at the end. Now here's my bar. It is an Olympic sized bar and it weighs 45 pounds. I love this bar a lot. It can hold up to 1500 pounds and it's fully customizable, meaning you can choose what you want the colors to be. This bar was pretty pricey though, coming in at $350 and I actually found a cheaper one that is just as good and at the end I will be telling you better and cheaper alternatives for all the equipment I have reviewed so far, so make sure you stay for that. Now we have this dumbbell rack. This thing is $60. It's very accessible and durable, and I like it a lot. The dumbbells that you see on it are not included, but you can buy them on Amazon, as well as these nice neoprene ones that I'm showing on the screen right now. Now, these are called bumper plates. They are for the rogue bar, and the price of this set is about $330. These are specifically designed for being quiet, so if you drop them, they do not make a noise, which is very nice for home gym. But, they are pretty expensive, so you might want to buy the ones I am mentioning at the end. This is a weight set. It is $83, and the weights add up to about 100 pounds. This is actually my first weight set, and I got it on my 10th birthday, but didn't really use it much up until last year. Anyways... This is a great set for a beginner, but if you have been working out for a while, then I would definitely recommend something more advanced. Here are the dumbbells. They are $12 on Amazon, and the brand is called Cat. You can get the plates for the bar on Amazon or their site. It is a pretty nice set, and really easy to use. So, we had bought a lot of our equipment at the start of COVID, so before the prices skyrocketed. All of that was maybe only half the price that it is now. Obviously, I'll link all the equipment I mentioned in the description, as well as the equipment I have in my home gym. Before we start going through the list, I would like to give credit to Garage Gym Reviews for making a lot of this list. The rack I would like to suggest is actually the one I have, the Fitness Reality Power Rack. It's $300, and this one is great if you do not have a spotter, because it has safety bars to catch the bars so you don't die. But if you do have spotters, then a cheaper one that does the job very well is the JX Fitness Multifunction Rack. It has a squat rack and a bench press rack. It even has some calisthenic cameras at the bottom of it. And it's less than half the price of the Fitness Reality Power Rack, coming in at only $140. For a bench, I was actually able to find a very good one. It's an Amazon Basic Squat Bench. It's made of solid metal, so trust me, it will not collapse on it. For the bar, we also have another huge deal. It's $60, and the brand is very well known. Some of you have maybe heard of it, but it's called Cat. It holds a great amount of weight, so unless you are squatting triple digits, you should be fine. But be sure not to get the wrong one, because there are different versions. This one is always 85. The dumbbells we picked out are very cheap. The Healthy You Dumbbell Package. And they're only $1,400. No, I'm just kidding. But the Yes For All Cast Irons would be the best option. They are completely adjustable, and the weights can go up to 200 pounds. Now, what's the one big bar worth if you can't even put any weight on it? That's why you need to buy the Champion Olympic Grip Plates. And you can choose what weight you want to buy. 2.5 pounds all the way up to 100 pounds. Last but not least, we are going with the Clout Fitness Clamps. They are $17 and they are very tight and easy to put on. You are probably going to want to buy these so the weights are not falling off your bar midlift. Because that would be bad. 
Well, I hope this helped you, and if you want to see what this equipment did to my muscles, then watch the video that is on the screen right now.